Hey y'all, check out this killer 87 K5 Blazer that we just got finished up with. We're gonna show you what all we did to it. Hope you like it. This thing has an awesome stance, beautiful color combination, and a power plant that can take you anywhere you wanna go. Although this wasn't a complete full build, we did a lot of cool things. We'll show you what's going on here in a second. As far as body and paint goes, this thing was already painted when it got here, but we repaired a few places. We also replaced the bumpers, the lenses, the moldings, the emblems, and the pinstripes. It really brought this thing back to life. You can see how clean this blazer is, how good the paint is, and how those new moldings and emblems really made this thing pop. After a good buffing, this was a totally different truck. It's amazing how wheels and tires can totally change the look of a truck. And these 17 by 9 US mags with 33 1250s sure did the trick. Underneath, we built a fully custom stainless TIG weld exhaust with a 2 in 2 out muffler and true dual exhaust all the way back. Everyone loves a good power plant. With this 430 horsepower LS3 tied to a 4L80E transmission, this blazer should go anywhere, anytime. We used a vintage air front runner serpentine system, hooker exhaust manifolds, and it's cooled by a US radiator's aluminum radiator with dual electric fans. To control the engine and transmission, we went with the Holly Terminator X Max. For those of you that don't know, this is one controller that does engine and transmission, so you don't have to have separate controllers for each one. When we installed the vintage air, we smoothed that side of the firewall and got rid of the factory AC box. While we were at it, we went ahead and media blasted and painted the firewall, inner fenders, and core support. Another nice little touch, especially for those shorter people, are these amp power steps. This is a killer system. It really helps you get in and out of the truck without messing the seats up. As we dive off into the interior, the first thing you see are those beautiful classic instruments gauges. We also had to change the steering column to an automatic column, as this was actually a four-speed manual truck when we got it. We put vintage air inside, a painless performance wire harness, and we built a custom roll cage for those in the back. To listen to those tunes, we built a full custom stereo system with an amplifier, four speakers, and a subwoofer. We got the dash bezel, dash pad, and a few other odds and ends from the interior from LMC truck, and it really wrapped that up nicely. We love the way this blazer turned out. It runs good, drives good, looks good, it's a total package, and we're stoked that the owner's going to drive this thing every day as a daily driver. We appreciate y'all taking the time to check our videos out. 
If you like what you see, hit that subscribe button and we'll have more content for you soon.